Hey guys, welcome to illustration number six. So in this thumbnail, I've decided that I'm gonna do an illustration with a gazelle and a desert fox. As for the background, I've decided since, you know, I'm using a desert fox, I have to make it you know somewhat in the desert so I've decided to add these uh, big rock surfaces in the background and obviously you know you can't have a desert without cactuses right so <laughs> I've added a few now I just want to throw a disclaimer that Animal fur is one of my weak spots when it comes to inking. I am not very good at inking animal fur. But when it comes to pencil shading, I could do a pretty good job. I'm not the best, but I know it would have been a whole lot better if the medium was, you know, with pencil. But since I want to do these illustrations, and ink. Everything must be in ink. Well, you know, the result that is. And here you also see that this is no typical gazelle. I added some some anime features to his face to show <laughs> To show that he is frustrated and suspicious of the fox. And since I wasn't going to go in and, you know, draw in the details with the pencil, I decided to just ink all the outlines and then I just go back in and just erase everything. That way, you know, I won't have to go back in and try to, you know, erase pencil marks after I've already inked in all the details. I just thought it'd be more convenient for me to do it at this point. And as you all probably know by now, if you guys have watched the other illustrations, that I do not like, you know, for my illustrations to be, or to have a lot of white spots, but I'm sorry, but this illustration is probably going to have, you know, a lot of white spaces. Just because, you know, I guess I got kind of lazy. I did at one point decide that I was going to go back in and actually tone it with um, wet ink. Just to have a, a different shade of gray, you know, just to add some color to the illustration but I decided you know I'm just gonna keep it like this just because well I guess to be frank I didn't want to spend um, another 10 hours on a illustration so I guess this is sort of like my cheat illustration but don't get me wrong I did spend quite a big amount of time on this illustration especially with inking the gazelle I think I spent the most time inking the gazelle in this illustration but like I've said guys you know since this is my first time inking you know this kind of this kind of fur I do want to tell you guys that it's normal for you to be frustrated when it's like your first time drawing something give it another shot like after you're done with the first attempt go back and you know go back another day or go back right afterwards and try to do the same thing over again I assure you that it's gonna be less frustrating and the results are gonna be hopefully a lot better and I know in all my illustrations I don't really 
guide you guys through what I'm doing. I'm just sort of telling you what I'm doing, and I'm sorry for that. Uh, maybe sometime in the future I can, you know, make new videos where I actually instruct you guys on how to do or how to draw certain things. But as for right now, I'm just sort of putting out videos that 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 hopefully is some form of entertainment for you guys because um, what I'm really trying to do is to give you guys like some sort of eye candy you know but it's not gonna be in that form where it's like 10 hours it's you know I don't want to you know make you guys watch like seven hours worth of footage I want to give you guys something that was done in seven hours but transformed into you know say a 10 minute clip because nobody has time you know nobody has that much time to go back and watch something that is eight hours long so but at the same time if you guys do get something out of these videos that makes me somewhat happy um, you know I do try to hope that you guys learn something from these videos you know even though it's not a lot I hope that it will inspire you and give you confidence to further your drawing and your technique and your dreams and as always guys I hope you guys will continue to join me in this journey I will be putting out more videos but remember guys in order to get better you have to keep drawing say whatever whatever medium you're using continue to use that medium every day you know sometimes I find it hard myself to get up and continue making these but you know you just got to find some form of motivation you know put yourself in that that habit find inspirational videos because you know in order to get better you have to continue the grind but yeah guys this is it for me I hope you guys enjoyed the video and as always I thank you guys for watching my videos and there will be more to come thank you